Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Elhamdülillahi Rabbil Alemin Ve sallallahu aleyhi ve sellem Ala nebiyyine Muhammed Ve ala alihi ve sahbihi ve sellem Amma ba'd Ahabbeti fillah As we mentioned before, that Islam, that the, that the shaitan comes to us in various ways. And as Sheikh al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah, and I'm sure before him, mentioned that the two ways in which the shaitan comes to you, the two paths, ash-shubahat wa shahwat, through shubahat, meaning doubtful things, and ashahwat, meaning your desires. And ashubahat, a habitifillah, can come in many, in various forms, and especially in this time, the times that we live in. Because now we have the technology to have information at the tips of our fingers instantly. And we are bombarded with that which turns you away from Islam, that which is deviant and claims to be Islam. For example, the way of the Sufiya, and the way of the Naqshbandiya, and the way of the Ibadiya, and the way of the Khawarij Takfiriya, and all of these various groups and sects, and the Shia, all seeking to turn you away from the Quran, to turn you away from the sunnah, to turn you away from the madhab of the salaf, or the various ways that it comes to you. So that's why we have to be careful, and we have to look to authentic information. That means we need knowledge to be able to discern between haq and batil. And so that's the first way the shaitan comes to us. And the second way, habitifillah, is through a shahwat. And again, with the technology, again, it's also a great danger in that we see we have information at our fingertips. You can type in anything and you'll see it. Anything and you will hear it. So the music today is worse than I think it's ever been. And it will only get worse. In that now there's no shame. Whereas before, at least in American music, you found that the music would allude to things. You know, the music of the 50s, the music of the 60s, the 70s, the 80s, the 90s. Now, 2000, it's, and now there's no shame. Now everything, everything you can imagine is spoken about. And that is on mainstream. So what about that which is underground? And likewise, what we have at our fingertips, whereas before it required maybe buying a magazine, having an adult purchase those kind of things, uh, videos and things. Now anyone, the youngest child can get anything, any filth you can imagine, whether it involves in animals, whether it involves children, whether it invo involves homosexuality, bestiality, does, it doesn't really matter. Mainstream people even endorse that they're trisexual or that they are all these other new terms which refer to new ways of filth. And that's all accessible. Ahabitifillah shubahat fear a shubahat fear the doubtfulness because it will take you away from your deen and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil sallallahu alayhi wa sallam ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam